hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be showing you a few products that i have that i want to make good use of um i've been kind of neglecting some of them a bit and i really want to commit myself to using them in videos when i'm not filming as well so let's get into my list i have these foundations the mac face and body it says you're supposed to use them within 24 months after opening but i don't really stick to those rules which is probably not very healthy but as long as the product doesn't smell bad or it still works i i always use it beyond the expiry date um so i really love these foundations i'm wearing it today they're not very full coverage so i think maybe that's why i haven't been using them a lot recently so i want to get back to using them next up i have these two concealers i have the la girl pro conceal in shade chestnut i use this as a foundation i'm gonna put some cards of videos that i've used um this in and i really love this concealer like i said i use it as a foundation but um i've realized that the color is not actually perfect it's a bit dark and olive toned i'm gonna speak more about this in monday's video um because i have a base routine video going up on monday but i've used quite a bit of it already so it's gonna finish pretty soon and i love the formula of this i love the coverage it's not full full coverage but it's very nice i'm sure that i'll also buy another shade at some point or i will find something else that i can mix with this and then i have this other concealer this is my highlighting concealer um i've also used a darker shade of this concealer and i loved that one too i also used it as a foundation i like using concealer as foundation guys and yeah i love the formula of this it's really creamy but i've been using it for a long time so i just want to find something else or revisit another product that i've used and liked in the past i have these bronzers you guys have seen these in many many of my videos i have other bronzers that i've seen that i'm interested in but i have to finish these first before i buy anything else because i don't want to be wasteful and this anastasia beverly hills one you can see i've hit major pan on it already and also i've hit pan on this one but yeah i'm gonna continue using these and i love them highly recommend next i have this laura messier secret brightening powder as you can see um this powder is like it's white it's white white i've never used it on its own because i'm afraid uh probably should actually and, and do like a a video on that but it's very white but i want to make use of it because i have it and i'm also interested in seeing how it works so i'm wearing it today but i mixed it with my benai banana luxury powder because that one is very yellow it's almost a little bit too yellow so i mix these two together and i like the finish that it gave so i'm excited to make good use of this powder because i've had it for a while and i have not touched it i i have the translucent version they came as a set actually and then i have two eyeshadow palettes i have this one the beauty treats modern matte i've had this for a very long time it's actually not available at this camp anymore but it's a really good palette you can see that i really like that brown shade i've used it quite a bit and it has a lot of bright colors i usually don't wear bright colors but i'm gonna dive into them those pinks there's a gray shade here this is interesting and the blue so you're gonna see me use this quite a bit the next eyeshadow palette i have is this nyx full throttle eyeshadow palette in the colorway called color riot 
I've had this since 2017. I actually bought it for my wedding and I love it. You can also see that I have a favorite shade here. And I've used the other shades, but not much. I have this primer. It's from Smashbox. It's called the Photo Finish Minimize Pores Primer. I really haven't used it much because it's a bit dry. It's supposed to help with oil and make your makeup last longer and kind of smooth your pores. But I don't like it, especially when I use it on its own. I always have to have something more moisturizing underneath before I put it. But I want to use it and finish it up. And like I said, I don't want to be wasteful. Lastly, I have this lipstick that I'm wearing. Kylie Cosmetics Matte Liquid Lipstick in Mary Jo K. I actually bought this from the Muse Beauty website a while ago. And I'm wearing it today. I really love this red. And I think it's getting dry, actually. It's getting really dry and goopy inside. So I've, I've also had this for a very long time. So that makes sense. So I'm going to get some use out of it before it's completely dry. So yeah, I really want to show you guys that you can use the same product, same eyeshadow palettes and create many, many looks out of them so that you get your money's worth out of every single product you have. You don't always have to go out and get something else when you already have um, a product um, that works. Thank you for watching my video. Subscribe if you haven't. Turn on your notification button and my next video is up on Monday, so I'll see you then. It's a very gloomy day in Pretoria today, so I think I'm going to get some coffee, some Starbucks, and then I'll come back, edit this video, and post it because I'm filming today on Saturday. I will see you on Monday.